it's time for the age-old question of what's best on negotiators? The negotiator backpack or anything that provides more damage? Well, this is entirely subjective and it is down to the individual. However, there are pros and cons with both. Just showing my testing here. Um, one thing I will note, and this is my personal preference as well, is I don't really rate the negotiator's backpack. You typically are sacrificing some form of crit damage, crit chance, as well as your time to kill and your average DPS across one enemy. Well, that seems a weird thing to come into because of how negotiators work, but your average DPS across one enemy is severely hindered like massively and after all of the testing and etc etc i've done i generally struggled with the rough setup that i was using um despite all the pieces being complete god rolled and all the mods being god rolled and trying to average out damage across the board when using the negotiator's backpack i genuinely struggled to kill one named elite in a magazine so what I have compiled is so obviously this will change build for build but when using the vigilance backpack I was hitting 694,524 shot and the crit transfer was 416,714 this gives me a total of 1,111,238 when using the negotiators backpack with foxes I was critting and the transfer was 573,537, giving us a total of 1,147,074. 1, when using the negotiator's backpack with Grupo for crit hit damage, we were getting 560,861 on crit and transfer, and our total damage was 1,121,722. Overall, including the crit and the transfer, the negotiator's backpack should give you more. However, you are going to be losing roughly, depending on your build, around 100k in single target DPS. And as I mentioned previously, when using the negotiator's backpack, the single target damage really, really does suffer. Which means that if you do get rushed, you're potentially going to die. If more than one enemy is coming towards you, you are potentially going to die. When dealing with Chungas, you are potentially going to die. Regardless, you're potentially going to die. As with any build, you can potentially die. However, increasing your single target damage will give you a higher overall performance, TTK, as well as you're actually able to kill something in one magazine. But having to reload really does hurt your chances. This is niche as hell. Like, it's really going to depend on your playstyle, how you build, what you're using, the weapons of choice. It really is completely dependent. The only thing I can really suggest to anyone, because this is one of those themes of where there's no real correct right answer. For me, personally, not using the negotiator's backpack is the way to go. Getting something like Vigilance in there with a Cheska piece simply just ups our crit chance and will technically give us a higher overall performance because our single target damage is going to be a lot larger regardless of how you want to look at it it's going to be larger because we now have two overarching damage talents on the chest and the backpack provided that's how you build whereas not using any other backpack and just sticking with the negotiator's backpack you are essentially losing a damage talent. All you're doing is transferring what damage you were already doing on crit to another NPC. This technically isn't a damage increase. It's a DPS increase because rather than hitting once, you're hitting twice, but they're not to the same target. So your overall single target DPS is taking approximately an 11% hit. Anyway, have fun. Good luck. Don't die. It's bad for the health.